Thanks for joining us today. I'm John with Caddy Daddy Presents, and this is Bob, who's just joined the team, and we've got some exciting information to share with you about our vision for the iconic 59 Cadillac Eldorado Barretts that we're building from the ground up. Excited. I'm excited to share this with all you guys and be part of this team here. So we've got the Cadillac that we're building here for Caddy Daddy Presents. And what's great is we're going to be able to um, share it with you. And I look forward to you guys coming with us and seeing the process that we're going to do with this very unique car. And what's great about it is, like I said, this is the Cadillac. This is something that was technologically advanced at the time. And we're going to use and utilize a lot of that amazing technology but with a twist. Oh yeah. Now what we're gonna do is, it's paying homage to this beautiful car and all of the beautiful, not just aesthetic features, but engineering features with it. But we're gonna make it drivable and we're gonna have some tricks. It's gonna be comfortable. That's what it's about. I love comfort. From doing the original bucket seats that came with the car, they'll have massage. Well, there's, I think that there's going to be some fantastic um, features on the interior. We're not going to tell it all right now, yeah. <laughs> as we go. Yeah. But this, this is a car that is, like I said, is going to pay homage to the original car. It's going to have, it, we're not taking away many of the amazing features that it came with that make it unique. But it's going to have things like four-wheel disc brakes. We're working on different types of induction systems for it. To make it a modern, drivable car, that there's going to have so many little tricks on it, but n nothing that really will jump out at you until you see it and the function of it. It's going to be technology a bit in subtlety and a car that's not subtle at all. It was an amazing car for its time, beyond its aesthetics, which is amazing, but also the way it was built. So it's going to be a fantastic balance of yeah. new technology, drivability, and a lot of re-engineered and reformed original style parts. Yeah, we want it to look like it's a 59 Cadillac Eldorado Baritz, but we want to put in all the trick comfortable items. The car itself from the factory, we're going to put every original option. I'd love for it to be able to park itself. All my vehicles do now. I love that feature and uh, my truck does. Big long truck, you just push the button, looks for a parking place. That is one of our goals and what you guys are going to see us do and that we're going to share with you is taking this beautiful vintage piece, once again, taking all the attributes that make it unique and special and engineered at its time and retrofitting several things. But one of the goals is of all of the many modern attributes that we can add to it, one of the main goals is that you don't see that. Yes, that's true. It'll be there, but it's going. It's it, every little thing will be surprised. There's going to be surprises on here, and yes. when talking about, there are many amazing cars that are being built, have been built over the years that have technological advances and retrofits. One thing that I have seen a lot is sometimes when they do build some of these styles of cars, they strip away some of the things that make them unique, some of the things that make. In, in a classic car, classic. This won't be that style. You're gonna see the process of full rebuilt factory style air suspension on this car, and you'll be joining us on the journey and seeing with that and also with the upgrades on there to make it more reliable, yet still have that classic look and feel for it. It's gonna be a really unique car because it's gonna be that balance of that classic and the technology. So right. we want to put that on there. And we, I look forward to 
um, getting input and even having questions and even getting sure. opinions from you guys out there. Sure. So, we, we, at some point in time, looking forward to doing a podcast and we'll take questions and answers uh, uh, for technical questions as well as answering questions uh, about the build and, and what we're going to do. Right now, we're at a point where you're seeing the beginning of this shop. You're going to see in the videos the shop evolve. Right. You're going to see the car evolve. You're going to see right now that we've got the skeleton right now. And you're gonna see the pieces, and you're gonna see all everything that is going to come together. And it's going to be an evolution because we're gonna, we might come up with more ideas. You might share ideas with us. And what will the finished project be is not set in stone. One of the great things that we have to work with is that this 59 Eldorado came from the factory with every single option that Cadillac offered. We're looking at Something where we're going to have an audio system inside this Cadillac, which is going to be unmatched. Yet it's also not going to be something that's going to look like an afterthought. And it doesn't it's have to be that loud, loud thump, thump, thump. No, we want quality. Quality. <laughs> yeah, quality. Definitely. <laughs> and with having other um, features in there, creature comforts, being from luxuries in, in the seat, from heated seats, massaging seats, like you'd like here, and touchscreen control, which would be a hidden unit on there. So it's going to be a retrofit. Yeah. I don't like to see that thing sticking out when I'm looking at the car. I look at these custom consoles. A lot of guys build it in. That's their style. I think ours, it'll be coming out and going away like it was never there, like the car still looks like a 59. I look forward to you guys joining us on this journey and seeing that things will change and it will evolve and we'll run into obstacles and we'll solve those and we will build an amazing piece. Okay.